Hi, everyone. Uh, just finished up a debate with Eric Murphy from Talk Heathen. And uh, interesting thing happened in the debate. I didn't respond to it in the debate, but uh, I shared my testimony just because there are always atheists who, when I give a bunch of arguments, I say, but that's not your real story. That's not the real reason you believe. So, okay, I'll just start off by uh, sharing a testimony. But uh, Eric responded by basically claiming that I need to be medicated because of my mental health problems. And uh, that's just so interesting. I mean, I'm 43 years old. I have a PhD, uh, multiple master's degrees, multiple bachelor's degrees, a wife, five kids. I don't hurt anyone. I don't want to hurt anyone. But because I'm a Christian and that just doesn't really work, I need to go be medicated. But uh, afterwards, um, people talked a long time afterwards. And uh, then Mark came up and had an interesting little story that I wanted him to share. So uh, tell us what your thoughts were on that, Mark. Well, essentially, uh, from my personal side, I also had problems growing up. I was uh, classified as a level five neurotic by the time I graduated high school by the state of Oklahoma because I tried to kill myself when I was five. I told my mom I wanted to die when I was five. I tried to kill myself when I was 15. Um, they sent me to over a dozen psychiatrists starting in, in ninth grade on. Uh, they tried legal medication. When I got into college, I tried illegal medication. There was a period of three or four years that I didn't have a waking moment that I wasn't chemically altered, and none of that helped. I tried self-help books, didn't help. And then after I became a Christian, I answer an altar call, someone lays their hands on me, prayed, and all of it was gone. And this wasn't trying to help heal yourself or help yourself. This was one instant, the blackness that had consumed my entire life from age five to the age of 25 was gone in an instant. It's been 25 years, and I haven't had an issue since. So should we tell Mark here that he needs to be medicated? Now, I, I just want to say, guys, uh, I'm not against medication. Some people do have issues that they need to take medication for. Some people do have issues that uh, it would really help them if they take uh, medication, even mental health medication. So uh, nothing against that. But what we're saying is, when Jesus enters your life and you are transformed, why would you want to say, no, let's go pump this guy full of drugs? Pretty silly. 